Hello, I'm Joe Wren. Law enforcement officials in Washington County, Tennessee, say two Bloomington residents were killed when the plane they were in crashed on Friday night. Cook Medical's Vice President of Engineering, William S. Bill Gibbons Jr., 45, and his daughter, Abby, 15, were killed when the single-engine plane crashed in the area of Johnson City. As the Herald Times reports, Federal Aviation Administration officials are still investigating the crash. FAA officials say the plane was on its way to Bloomington from Knoxville. Indiana University's Alpha Tau Omega chapter has been shut down, but the university could still take disciplinary action against the individual students involved in a sex video scandal. ATO's National Fraternity Office revoked the IU chapter's charter last week. IU was still investigating whether the students involved violated its student code of conduct. If the investigation uncovers violations, the students would each have to attend a hearing. IU spokesperson Mark Land says if the hearing board determines there is a violation, a wide range of disciplinary actions could be taken. And Hoosiers might want to stock up on canned pumpkin well before Thanksgiving. An Associated Press report says there could be a shortage of canned pumpkin after a large amount of rain hit the Midwest this summer. While most pumpkins in the U.S. are grown in central Illinois, there are still several farms that harvest pumpkins in Indiana. Some farmers who experienced heavy rains later in the summer might not have had been able to replant their fields. And not much rain in the forecast tonight, mostly clear, lows down to 48. And in the five-day forecast, tomorrow partly cloudy, 62. Sunny conditions on Wednesday, highs in the mid-60s. Then a slight chance of rain on Thursday, highs up to 69. We have more news online at WTIUnews.org.